What's going on, you guys? It's your boy, Jeremy Cash, and I got some good news for you today, guys. I stumbled across a system that's absolutely free, and it's going to help you crush it in your business. So before this video starts, hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Uh, follow me on Instagram, all my social media. Now let's get into this video because I'm excited, all right? So uh, it's companies out there called ClickFunnels, and it's another company called BuilderRaw that's very, 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 very popular, right? The only two problems with those companies are when people are just getting started, they may not have the funds for it, okay? And then they may not want to spend monthly fees because they already have enough monthly fees coming out already from other things that they're doing. So this system right here is absolutely free, and you can build so many funnels. Um, and then they have an uh, autoresponder, a text blaster, and so much other stuff that I'm going to get into right now. Okay, so uh, when you first get signed up, you can sign up in the description below this video uh, to this account. Okay, once you get signed up on your left hand side, you will see all of these tabs. You can go to drag and drop editor. Now, I've been testing this out. Uh, these are these are just, you know, part of a funnel that I'm messing around with uh, just to, so I could show you guys how it works. But your when you first get signed up you should be able to create yours right here but um if not then it's these three bars up here at the top you can click that and then click create capture page okay so once you create your capture page it's very 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 simple guys you just kind of pick out the template that you want okay so for instance if you just want you know a template with no video on it okay you can do that if you want the video at the top if you want your video on the side and then them to enter the information in right here they can do that if you just want a picture uh, and then, uh, you know, then put their information in. So they have a number of different things you can do. Uh, for instance, I guess for this purpose, I'll choose this one. OK, normally I probably wouldn't do a video um, just because, you know, you don't want to give away too much information. But that just depends on what you guys are trying to do. OK, so I'll pick this one and then I'll go here and then you can pick the color scheme of it at the bottom. All right. And then I'll click next. Now, you can add a background image. Now you can actually add your own. As you can see, I was messing around with this. I had a, had a team riot one, and then the Wealthy Empire one. But uh, the ones I really like, I'm gonna scroll down here. Let me click off of this blue. Some of the ones that I really like is like the women at the beach, uh, things like that. It's like really bright, really eye catching. They have you know stuff at the desk. You know people living their their good life. Okay. So you can use a couple of these. Uh, there's another one that I really like that I use all the time, which is this one, <laughs> the lady sitting at the laptop. So for this one, I'll probably just choose this right here. Okay, so I'll choose this and I'll go down and just click next. It's very simple, guys. Now on this part, this is where, you know, you could determine what you want them to put in when they opt in. Do you want them to put their just their first name and email or do you want them to add their phone number? If you do the phone number, they do have a text broadcaster on here. Uh, so it just depends on what you want to do. You could also add more, but normally when you do an opt-in page, you normally usually just have an email or first name and email or phone number. It just depends on how you want to do it. So I'll, for this one, I'll just take the phone number off and I'll just click next. Okay. Now on this page, this is for your, your submit button. So if you wanted to say submit, you know, once they enter the information or you could just say, you know, uh, I would just keep it submit. <laughs> I would just keep it submit just to keep it, you know. Well, let me change that. Okay. Yeah, we'll just keep it submit for there. And then you could change the color of the button if you want to. It could be red or whatever. If you had a customized button that you wanted to do, you can do that. Uh, but for now, we'll just leave that. Okay. Now, this part here is pretty cool. Uh, if you have a video, let's go to, you know, YouTube.com. And I'll just pick any random video just to kind of show you guys how this works. Now, this is if you have if you clicked on the one that had the video opt in page. Uh, this is, you know, something that's really cool that you could do. My Internet's kind of going a little slow. So I'll just pick. I was good. I just refreshed it. OK, so I'll just pick this. Any video just to, you know, show you guys. So you can literally go here. Paste your video here. If you had a Vimeo video, you could do that. You could choose whether you want it to auto automatically start when they click on the page. Uh, and then I'll show you some other things here in just a second. All right, so I'll put the video link here. Bingo. 
So as you can see, this is very simple, guys. So this right here is something that you, it, that automatically pops up at the top of the page. If you want to preview it, you click on the preview, and it'll show you exactly what it's going to look like, okay? So, you know, I'll put that video here, right? And they have the form here. Like the submit button, you can add, say whatever you want to. But right here, you can actually change this to say whatever you want to, and I'll show you how to do that in a second. But what's really cool is up here at the top, you can click on the different views. So on the phone, it would look like this. If you turn the phone sideways, it would look like this, and they'll have to scroll down, you know. Then they have, you know, different templates like the iPad and things like that. So that's cool that you, you know, you're able to see that kind of stuff, right? And that's just on the uh, preview tab up here, okay, as you're creating. Now, for this part, um, you can download a program called GIMP, GIMP 2.8 or something like that. It's like Photoshop. That's what I have. It's free. It looks kind of like this right here, this icon at the bottom. And you can literally, like, create your own, you know, templates or whatever, your own wording that has transparent background. If not, you can download an app called PixArt and do the same thing. Uh, but you can literally put whatever you want to. Uh at the top instead of having these words because these are just templates that they created but you can literally create your own words or you can just write your own text you know and it'll be a box here uh you can write your own text out if you want to do it that way okay so it's a couple of different ways to do it uh i usually create mine because i can change the fonts and i think with the text you can't really do too much but so you guys got the gist of that okay so we'll go to the next page okay so the page title this is just you know I believe what you want to show up if you ever share the link on Facebook or something. So you can say whatever it is. I'll just say earn, um, you know, money working from home or something like that. And then the page description, I'll just, I'm just typing in blah, blah, blah stuff right now because I don't want to have to go through all of that. But you guys will get the gist of this. Boom. Then you'll just save it. You can, you know, preview it. Okay. So it looks exactly the same how we saw it before. That's what your, uh, page will look like right so once you save that it'll go into your um, one of your folders okay and you can click here to publish it now once you publish it you can add to your current sales for I mean yeah you can publish it and then you can add to your current sales funnel right so we'll just add to our current sales funnel okay so now instead of clicking this here you will just click a uh, web sales page right all right, so now that you have that, here's your sales page. You'll click create. Okay. Now, this is a very simple drag and drop system. God, I've been trying to tell you this is very simple drag and drop. So you have all these different things here at the top, right? Now, normally after they opt in, usually you'll have just like a video here or a navigation. If you want to do, you just, you just grab it and you drag it down here. Okay. And it'll show up. You can put your logo right here. You could change these to, you know, whatever you want the tabs to be. Very simple. Uh, but normally on a on a second page, uh, so that it's not such a big distraction, you could just like add a video, uh, or view, you know, explaining what it is. So it'll show up like this. And then if you want to just add a button for them to go to the next page, or you can go here and you can click action, and it'll add an action button. Give me a second here. See if I can drag that down here. Maybe have to. Sometimes it takes a one of these. You gotta like put it at a certain like thing. Maybe if I put it at the top first and then drag it down, that may work. Okay, so it works if I put it at the top. Then I gotta drag it down. Okay. There we go. Okay, sorry about that, guys. But okay, so boom. Now you got that. So now once they go from your funnel, then they you can actually change this video by clicking on it. It's probably actually going to play, but you can click here on this little pencil icon. You'll go here. You'll paste your video link in here. So I'll paste that same video link in there. And if you have Vimeo, you can use Vimeo. Uh, then what you want to do, because it'll make the video really small, you can do uh, large or extra large. So we'll do uh, extra, I'll do extra large on this one. And then you can add text or color section to it or whatever. Blah. Boom. So now, you know, you got yourself, you know, a funnel. So when they first put their information in, uh, then it'll take them to this page and then they'll, you know, uh, watch this video and then you could take them to another page or you can have them join the opportunity. So it can, it's completely up to you. 
Uh, now, when you're dealing with this action button, uh, I wouldn't say do funnel action because it, it doesn't, um, this one doesn't really work as well. I'm trying to see if I can delete it. Okay. I would say use action. So not funnel action, but use the action one because this is the one that you can change and actually have them redirect to somewhere else. Okay. So make sure you use action instead of funnel action. I haven't really messed with this too much, but it's so many different icons that you guys can use and play around with. Uh, I just like literally found out about this, so I wanted to make sure I showed you before I got too deep into it, so you guys can mess around with it too. But um, so you would be able to click that, and you can add like a video link uh, right here. And then if you wanted to add, uh, I mean not a video link, but a action link on where you want them to redirect. So when they click join now, where do you want them to go? So you'll put whatever website that is there. If you have another button that you want to do, you can add another button or a third or a fourth one. So I'll show you what two would look like, okay? It would say join now and join now. And you could actually change join now into something else, okay? So that's completely, you know, up to you on how you guys would want to do that. Let me see here. Yeah, that's completely up to you on how you guys would want to do that. Or you could put some text up here and if you had different levels and things like that. Uh, something else is really cool about this is they do have like a when you do pricing so let's say I was to try to do pricing let's say you were selling a product or something like that so I'll do this at the top first uh, let's say you were selling a product and you had this is cool right so they automatically you know have it right here and then you can just change these prices to like a hundred dollars here boom 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 whatever you want the name of it to be uh, and they already have it set up like that so really really cool uh, something that you guys will be able to use since I'm pressed for time on this because I got 15 minutes on this thing So I'm at 11 about 12. So I'll just go ahead and save and publish that and then you'll name you know the title I'm just putting a bunch of crap. So you you know, don't worry about all this part Just a bunch of nonsense and it will save that right after that um, You pretty much done uh, You will want to go back to your dashboard Okay and then you want to come over here on the side and go to system capture pages and then you can pick I mean well make sure you make sure your um your pages are published make sure you click publish because once you publish them uh they will look you know somewhat like like these cuz these are the ones that are already made okay so you will make then you you will see here these are the uh stock ones that they already have so you will have a number 2 right here you'll click that Okay, and then you these will be the ones that you created you click make your primary page. It'll give you a link But first before you do that you want to click on edit Because you want to make sure your redirect URL is in there. Okay, so when they put in their opt-in form uh, Their opt-in uh, name or whatever you can click on basic settings and this is where you want them to redirect. Okay, so you can click here to select the page and then you select your funnel page. So after they opt in, you click the select page here. It'll it'll paste it in there and then that's where they'll redirect to. Hopefully I'm not confusing you guys. If I am, just you know, contact me and then I'll I'll go over it a little more. But once you do that, your link will be right here. So it says click here to access your link, click here, and then you have your funnel. Okay. One of the cool things about this is once they put their name and email in, it sends an email to you. Okay, via it sends a text message to your phone and it also sends you an email letting you know someone opt in, opted in. So, you know, when when someone opts in here, you know, I'll get an email. It'll it'll take them straight to to a presentation page. Okay. Boom. Okay. And it sends me an email, let me know I got a lead. And another thing that's dope over here, guys, is the email autoresponder. So it automatically has its own autoresponder, right? So you come in here and you can edit this right so once they opt in this is the message that you want it to send to them instantly as soon as they opt in the, this program will automatically send them a message to their email so what do you want yours to say you can put that in here you can actually you know go down here copy if you wanted to say their name so mine will say you know their name and are you ready to work things like that so really dope guys I have about 30 minutes left but uh the text blaster costs I think like a few bucks or something um, and things like that but it's so much stuff it comes with the autoresponder you can do an auto uh, autoresponder series 
and a lot of other stuff. So play around with this system, guys. If you love this video, hit it with a like button and comment below what you think. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.